Okay, so I thought I'd show you how we're going to make these exactly 90 degrees of the table surface. And as I said before, we're going to use my little friend here, some aluminium tape. And all we have to do is just cut some strips to approximately 15 millimeters. Peel, if we can do this, peel them off. Okay, that one's not being so clever. Uh, gotcha. Okay. And we're going to put it onto the table here. It doesn't matter if it covers the hole at this moment, and actually that's a rather good idea that if it, if it does. So we want... So I've, I've done the other side already, and it takes about four of the 15 millimeter width to make it true. So there's number two. And this is self-adhesive aluminium tape. It's extremely strong. The glue uh, or the adhesive backing is really very, very strong. And it's like putting a little piece of metal onto the table saw that won't move. So there's number three. And here we come with number four. I'm not so sure of the thickness of this aluminium tape, but it's very, very thin. So sometimes the adhesive backing takes a little bit of work. Okay, so there's number four. Now, when we put this against here and take our measuring square and come across here, we can see we've done part of the job but not all of it. So, we need to make some smaller pieces just in the top here. So, that just means cutting each piece in half. And another four pieces will do the trick nicely. So, we'll cut that. Cut that one. Okay, peel them off. And this goes right to the very top, right there. All fingers and thumbs today. Here we go. That's two. And the last one, number four. So, we have four pieces on the top. This aluminium tape is very, very pliable. You can actually do what you like to it. It forms around anything. Now for our hole here that we've already pre-drilled. Screwdriver, suck. Here's our bolt. Put the washer in the nut in the back. Tighten it up. Now take your bracket. The bracket goes in behind the washer, of course. Let's get a little looser. Bring the bracket up. Just gently tighten it. Now, we're going to take the square here I'll bring this around a bit. This, this edge here now has to be exactly 90 degrees with this. If not, we have to use more aluminium. But let's just take a look. Okay, that's perfect. So, even though this is not 90 degrees, now we've made it 90 degrees. And when we tighten that, we leave it a little bit loose for the moment. Now we have to do this one. The other two have been done. When all of these are 90 degrees, then we can start putting the rails on.